Godzilla, King of the Monster. No, 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 no. This is no Shakespeare in Love. This is no an Oscar nominated movie. This is no a Christmas tear joking. This is Godzilla biting monsters. Are they going to be okay? Rotten Tomatoes give you 41%. 41%? All the credits trash in this movie. This is Godzilla. This is me, Frankie D. You are in your reviews. Don't forget to subscribe. My take on Godzilla, King of the Monsters. As a fan like you, is the movie great? And we're going to enjoy it? Or oh, the critics is right. And it's trash. My review coming up. Like I said in the beginning, this is no Shakespeare in Love, this is no Titanic, this is not something you're gonna win an Oscar. This is Godzilla. Yes, Godzilla. And try to buy, battle all these monsters. Don't go so deep. Don't try to look for something else than what it is. In 2014, we come out with the first Godzilla. A lot of people didn't like it. I like it. They didn't like it because Godzilla didn't appear until the end of the movie. I thought it was a good beginning of the story. This is part of the three movies coming up. Two years ago, we had Kong. That was awesome. I don't know who didn't like that movie. That was amazing, that movie. And now we have Godzilla, the continuum, different director, from 2014, they continue the story, beating the monsters. And we have all the titles, the famous one. And we have uh, Kyle Chandler, Vera Farmiga, the two major actors, and especially Chandler, who's been in so many TV shows and movies, but he is the movie in this one. He's the main character. Vera Farmiga, like always, can't do anything wrong. But the story is okay. The good part is you see Godzilla right on it. You see a monster right on it from the beginning. I mean, really, you don't have to wait an hour and a half, two hours to see somebody fighting. You already see them. And you see a lot of the story. It's two hours and 14 minutes. This is what it is. Yes, you're waiting for Godzilla and all the titans, the three hit monster, the dragon, and everybody else who come in here. I mean, really, of course, you're going to see the stupidity of the people. This is not their fault. It's humanity fault because uh, we did this to ourselves. We had to destroy ourselves to save the species. Shut up and give me more Godzilla. Shut up and give me more fight. I mean, really, if this is for the person who want to see a movie deep and a great story and very theatrical, no, you go there to get your soda, your popcorn, and you enjoy the movie. Is that the movie you're going to see? Absolutely. It's a yes, it's a go, don't go, or must go. In my opinion, if you that's what you're looking for, a Godzilla fighting all the titans, Godzilla just doing what he does best, destroy everybody. <laughs> this is your movie. This is your movie to have fun, to have your soda, your popcorn, you enjoy with your girlfriend and your kids, and just have fun and enjoy it. Try to see it in the good theater. Don't go there and try to see it in small. See, if you want to see an IMAX, go. But if you don't want to pay for the IMAX, see it in a nice screen, big screen, because it's worth it to see something. The special effects, amazing. The director did a good job, and the music, I can't remember the name, but the guy who composed the music is the same guy who did the score for the great game God's of War uh, for the PlayStation. Uh, my buddy Walter loved that game, probably played like 20,000 times. And that music from that game is the same guy who did this music. The score is great, the music is great, uh, great tone, cinematography is great, the special effect, like always, great. CGI is all CGI, you know these monsters are CGI no matter what. And it's good, it's, it's, it's a good, fun movie. Don't go too much. And sometimes it's a little bit slow 
when they go on the story and sometimes you see the little things that just you see before and say, oh, come on, give me a break. She's an evil, she, he's an evil, whatever. I just, the bad guy, the good guy, and you see this before, but and then what you want to see, you want to see Godzilla fighting the three-head dragon. You want to see Godzilla fighting everybody else. You want to see Godzilla destroying the, the city. You want to see that, and that is a good movie. That's a good popcorn movie. And Godzilla, King of the Monster, deliver. Deliver for fun, entertainment, and it's worth your 14 $15, in my opinion. And if you agree with me, give me a thumbs up and tell me you agree with me. If you disagree with me, give me a thumbs up. But if you like it, give me a like. And until the next time, I hope you enjoy this movie because it's a must-go, in my opinion, and it's worth it. Till the next time, enjoy your movies. Support your movie theater, support your TV shows, support your video games, and give me a hand. Like it could see that support me. Hit my head with Yoda and subscribe. The other reviews are here. Until the next time, thank you and ciao.